the deal was if I got my permit uh, before Friday, which is tomorrow, then I would be able to go. Hey, good morning, everybody. It's a beautiful, gorgeous morning in Florida and I'm headed over to my parents' house for breakfast. Um, I don't go over there for breakfast very often, but today my brother and sister-in-law are in town. They came down from North Carolina, so I'm so excited to see them. They are an absolute delight. My whole family is an absolute delight. You know, we talk about family a lot, and that's really the mission of our channel is to um, change the world by raising happy families. And um, I came from a wonderfully, wonderfully happy family. It's funny, growing up, so I'm the youngest of five children, and um, I never really knew how special our family was until I started to see that other people didn't have the same thing, and that made me sad. And I thought, well, the best way that we can proliferate this family happiness is just to emulate it and um, just to live it and give people an example of how to emulate it. Because, I mean, not that I want to tell people the way they need to live, but I gotta tell you, when you grow up in a happy family, nothing's better like you have such a foundation of love and strength and confidence and courage and all those good things so um, I think that families Mike's the same way he grew up in a very happy family too so anyway I am um, totally blessed and we make every effort we can um, even though now we're all adults with our own children and everything. As you guys know, if you've been watching for a while, you know we make every effort we can to be together. Oh, oh my God, so, Mike and Michelle are, are here, and I'm going to go have breakfast with them and spend the day with them uh, for the most part. I'm headed back, well, I'll tell you, I'll let Ryan tell you um, what the next couple of days look like because he has because he has something to tell you. Let's put it that way. <laughs> I am waiting for Mike and Michelle. And my mom and dad probably. Who is it? I think it's mom. Good morning. <laughs> Hello. Okay, what's happening everyone? Uh, it's your favorite Donnelly and I'm hopping on here um, just to give you a little breakdown of today and tomorrow and what's happening right now. Uh, so I'm 16 years old, recently moved uh, down to Florida and uh, I was eligible to get my driver's permit um, from the moment that I came down here because I was 16 when I moved. Uh, and I never really did. I kind of got lazy. I kind of just didn't care about it. And I realized how much of a, you know, a pain that would be. And I waited way too long. Anyway, uh, so I finally, you know, did all the stuff necessary to get it. And, um, there was a deal made between me and my mom that, uh, I wanted to go back to Maryland and, uh, go skiing. Cause there are some ski resorts up there well really there in pennsylvania you know what i mean though anyway uh i would love to go back and go skiing because uh i love skiing we did a lot last winter and there's not a lot of snow around here to uh do it in anyway uh the deal was if i got my permit uh before friday which is tomorrow then i would be able to go up to maryland we booked flights and she said you're only coming if you have your permit in your hand so i said okay I um, spent the weekend with my sister because she was down here, so I didn't get a lot of it done. So yesterday and Monday, um, I grinded a lot and I got it done. So uh, we, I passed my whole permit test. Uh, I did everything, we made an appointment. So if uh, I have everything good and I have everything necessary, I think I do, uh, we have an appointment at 11.45. I'm gonna get pulled out of school, we're gonna go do that. And um, if they give me the card, 
then I'll be on my way to Maryland tomorrow. So I'm super excited about it. All I can do is sit and wait really right now. Uh, but um, yeah, that's what's happening. So stay tuned to see if I get it because that'd be pretty devastating if I don't. Anyway. All right, guys, we are all at Pop Stroke. We came out tonight, just had a little bit of dinner. Nana is first up. Pop Stroke is a place where you can do putt putt for miniature golf and eat dinner. Good job. Good job. Good job. Look at the yardage on, books. It's going to be a tough week. Wind's always going to be a factor. Uh, luckily, the lighting here is great, so that shouldn't be it shouldn't be an issue. But you know, looking to put up a low score today, just make the cut, get it to the weekend. How's the music going to affect you during this play? You know, there's going to be different uh, forms of adversity every week, but you know, you just got to get over that. I've I've trained with music, uh, so you know, I, I really don't think it'll be a factor. Hey, good luck out there. Hey, thank you very much. No matter how hard my life would treat me, I'd always get right back up. Never worry, cause I got. Super fun. <laughs> Feels so bad for Nana, but she took it all in stride. Thank goodness. She is like the originator of having a great attitude about things and just knowing that like if something happens, you can 
you can always overcome it, which is great. So anxious to see how she feels tomorrow. We're, um, she wasn't, she decided not to go to urgent care. Instead, she's just gonna, we talked to Katie on the phone and Katie was like, no, I don't think you should go to urgent care. Not that she's a doctor, but she's like, just elevate it and take some Advil and put some ice on it and then see how it feels tomorrow. Because, you know, she's had those things happen to her, as has Ryan, as has Brennan. All of them have had wrist issues before. Anywho, also tomorrow, big day. I have some paperwork that I need to do, that I need to complete before Ryan goes to get his um, permit. So I'm gonna go complete that paperwork now. Um, so we have all of our ducks in a row and hopefully that document will have gotten to the DMV or the whatever it is, a tax collector, so he can get his permit. Why are you laughing? <clears throat> Because <laughs> it is like, by the skin, look at, he's pretty optimistic. He's packing his bag. He pretty much thinks he's going to go. What do you think, Ryan? Oh, well, yeah. Like, well, if I do get to go, then it'd be pretty awkward if I was like, just dipping without a bag. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You have to prepare. Anyway. You never know. Yes. Uh, I had a great time golfing with everyone. I didn't even know it was happening until yesterday. I didn't know I was have a shower coming down until yesterday. Um, and when Nana felt, first of all, well, I didn't, I felt bad, but also it reminded me of when, remember I sprayed my wrist snowboarding? I do. I fell, put my hand out in front of me. Same thing. Fell on my left wrist like three different times. Same thing. Yeah, exactly. That video is good too. Isn't that it? is. Hey, you guys, if well, you oh yeah. Link, link, link the video. Stay in car to watch the video. It's it's actually great. I'm like 12, but fantastic. <laughs> Poor um, thing. His very first time snowboarding. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Come with me, guys. Have a we'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.